After more than two years of waiting, the Knapp Center reconstruction project finally moving forward. Crew started Tuesday by removing the letters of the building. Faye Lee tells us what the final product could look like and how long it'll take to complete it. It's a building tied to the history of downtown Lansing. The Knapp Center building was completed in 1937 in an architectural style popular at the time. It was considered ultra modern architecture at the time and was actually one of the finest intact examples of streamlined art modern architecture in the Midwest today. But anyone walking by today might say it's lost some of that luster. We're not fond of it, but I mean at the same time, I mean we're looking forward to it getting fixed and becoming beautiful once again. People walking around this part of downtown Lansing will probably see a lot of construction here the next 12 to 14 months. I'm told the restoration project starts with getting rid of some of those glass panels. But because it's a restoration project, it's also about preservation. As seen in this rendering, the new building will maintain the architectural style of the old. The inside, however, is a different story. It's going to be a mixed use building. There'll be residential units on the top floor, 22 uh, single story units and one kind of special two story unit, so 23 units in total. Then there'll be three floors of office space. Our company will be moving back into one of those floors. Plus retail stores and even room for fashion designers. It means something for the psyche of downtown. So many people know the Knapps building, this iconic structure that they grew up in, that they grew up with. It's a $36 million project that city leaders hope will bring more people and revenue to downtown. In Lansing, Faye Lee, Fox 47 News. The project is funded by a mix of loans, federal, state, and local tax credits. Construction could be complete as early as December of 2013.